These are an assortment of self-drilling drywall anchors. They require no power drills at all, not even a pilot hole, and can actually be installed with only a screwdriver. Some of them are simply self-drilling and insert themselves into the drywall, and others will actually expand in the back for more holding power while the other ones with these little blue tabs you see will actually grab the back of the drywall similar to a toggle bolt so making it somewhere in between the regular self-drilling drywall anchors and something like a toggle bolt the one on the left here is a self-drilling it's called a driller it's a self-drilling toggle bolt so you'll actually use the self-drilling tip again without even a power drill turn it clockwise into the drywall which will create a hole which will then push forward and then you can install the bolt which will pull a toggle in the back so that one is obviously going to be the most strength out of these I'm going to do a sheer strength test for these in a few minutes here and we'll see how much weight these things can withstand before they fall out of the wall. I'm not going to do a pull-out test here because if you're using these for something like a towel rack or a handlebar, then you're asking for trouble. These things are great for picture hanging, things that are stationary, something that's just going to hang on the wall, even a heavy mirror. Some of these can hold up to 100 pounds or even more, uh, but I wouldn't use it for anything hanging from the ceiling or anything that's going to be used and pulled on, even a coat rack or something like that. For that, I would install directly into the studs or in the case of the ceiling, a joist to get it actually into the wood. If you had to hang something very light from the ceiling, like a plant or something, then you can use a toggle bolt if uh, the spot where you want the plant isn't the, exactly where a wood stud is. So here you have the assortment. This is a self-drilling screw by OOK. It says it can hold up to 100 pounds, and I actually believe it. Surprisingly, this held up a lot of weight in the, in the sheer, sheer strength test, as you'll see. You can also install that into a wood stud, but it's designed for drywall. This one here is a self-driller that's made out of metal. It claims to be able to be used in a hollow door. Uh, in that case, I would definitely install a, I would definitely drill a pilot hole through the door because when I tried to put this thing into some wood, it split. So self-drilling, not exactly. Uh, as far as using it in drywall, you can. It just doesn't expand in the back. So it's probably not as strong as these other ones. These here, these are actually two different sizes. Uh, one can hold 50 pounds and the other 75 pounds. They're by Easy Anchor. They will, you can, you can install a pilot hole if you want to make it easier and put it more accurately exactly where you want to put it. And then you can just drill it in and turn it into the, uh, the drywall and then install your screw. These are good for something that you can back the screw out and it'll still stay pretty stationary. If you want to hang something off the screw, they will expand in the back, making them a little bit more stronger than simply drilling into the drywall. These ones with the blue tabs, they, they will actually grab the back of the drywall if you continue to turn the screw. It's like you have to over torque it once you get the screw all the way in. The problem with that is you can't back the screw out. I tried to do that and it started to unthread itself from the drywall. So you have to make sure whatever you're installing, you're going to screw that screw all the way in. The other drawback is the screw will be wobbly when you screw it into where the, uh, the blue part. That's the self driller. The driller, you can uh, drill that, screw that into the drywall and then the toggle flips back once you push the bolt in. All of these can be installed with using just a screwdriver. You, you might want to mark the spot on the drywall, maybe with an awl or a screw, 
just to, for more accuracy and then these things can actually drill themselves. Okay, you want to do the strength test. This is a luggage scale, and I'm pulling up with that amount of force on the little OOK picture hanger screw in just drywall. Not screwed into the wood at all, and it managed to hold up for 67 pounds. It didn't even pull out of the drywall. It just kind of dented the drywall and basically would have failed at that point. And then trying the metal one, the metal self-driller, which actually failed at a smaller amount of weight, 57 pounds before it rips completely out of the drywall. And then trying the, the wall driller anchor, I managed to pull up 95 pounds weight and it didn't even budge. It didn't budge one bit. Now trying the easy anchors, the white self-drilling ones. Pulling up, sheer strength, over 88 pounds. Again, didn't budge. So I didn't even try the toggle, the self-driller toggle, because that would obviously hold up as much as that I could pull. This isn't exactly the most scientific test, but for the purposes of hanging things on the wall, pretty much any of these would be pretty good, up to at least 50 pounds. Some of them much more wouldn't use, wouldn't put uh, too much weight on it. Otherwise, when you start getting up to over 100 pounds, you may as well really try to uh, fasten into a stud. But as far as drywall anchors, most of these are pretty good. In fact. A little OOK picture hanger did much better than I thought it would. Even better than the small self-drilling style that doesn't snap open in the back of the drywall. So if you want to try any of these for your purposes, I have a link in the description. Please subscribe for more tips just like these.